Dear students, welcome to my channel Structures for Architecture. I am Meghadatta Basu. In this video, I will discuss about the GATE examination for architecture, GATE 2021. GATE stands for Graduate Aptitude Test in Engineering. Through GATE, you can get admission for the Masters as well as the doctoral programs with Ministry of Education scholarships. You can also get through PSU jobs via GATE SCO. These are the following institutes through which you can get admission for the AMARCH program through GATE score. So here are the list IIT Roorkee, IIT Kharagpur, NIT Tiruchirapalli, NIT Kalikat, NIT Hamirpur, then SPA Delhi, SPA Vijayawada, SPA Bhopal, then Jadupur University Kolkata, Aligarh Muslim University Aligarh, Central University of Rajasthan and uh, 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 Ajmer and then Guru Nanak Devi University Amritsar, Bharti Vidyapeet uh, College of Architecture Pune, Dr. APJ Abdul Kalam Technical University Lucknow, JNIAS School of Planning and Architecture Hyderabad and BMS School of Architecture Bangalore. So let us have a look at the GATE 2021, some important dates over here. The opening date of application is September 14, 2020. Please mark it in your calendar. Uh, for registration, you have to visit gate.iitb.ac.in because IIT Bombay is the organization uh, committee for this uh, GATE 2021. Remember, the closing date of application is September 30, 2020. You can download your admit card on January 8, 2021. Here are the date of the exams. February 5th to 7th, that is Friday, Saturday, San Sunday. Then February 12th to 14th, again Friday, Saturday, Sunday. And the timing are 9 a.m. to 12 p.m. and 3 p.m. to 6 p.m. That means from uh, 5th to 7th and 12th to 14th, this 3 and 3, 6 days, you are having 2 slots, morning slot and the forenoon slot and the afternoon slot. So, while downloading the admit card, you will come to know which date, which time you have to appear for the exam. And finally, the date of the result is 22nd March 2021. Let us have a look at the criteria for GATE 2021. The good news over here, now from this year, fourth year, final year and the pass out students of architecture, you can apply. Actually, this is like uh, pre-final year, final year and the pass out students. As architecture course is of five years, so the fourth year, fifth year and the pass out students can apply for GATE. There is no criteria for the minimum percentage in BR. So that is a good news for all of you that uh, no certain percentage you have to achieve to appear for gate there is no age limit there is no attempt limit because in several exams and previously also there were that you cannot attempt more than two or three times so this type of limit attempt limit has been withdrawn now so and you are also eligible that is the most good news that if you are having backlog papers then also you are eligible to appear for gate 2021 that is really a good news for many of you and uh, the last point is gate 2021 scorecard will remain valid for three years that means you are qualifying gate in 2021 so that scorecard will be valid till 2024 from the date of announcement of result, that is the 22nd March 2021, the result is announced. So, from there, three years. Let us have a look at the what are the changes in the exam pattern in GATE 2021. See, the first uh, option that has been introduced, that is the multiple select options. I have put a star over here because that is the new thing which has been or that is the change which has been incorporated in GATE 2021. Previously, it was not there. Then there is multiple choice question and then there is numerical answer type questions that is NAT. Now total th the paper will be of 100 marks and the time will be of 180 minutes that is 3 hours. So out of uh, these 100 marks, 15 marks is from the general aptitude. There will be 10 questions and 15 marks. And from the main subject, main subject means your architecture subject, there will be 55 questions and of 85 marks. So total marks is 100, total time is 180 minutes, that is 3 hours and questions are of 1 mark and 2 mark. Obviously then that's why it is 10 questions, 15 marks. Some questions 
will be of one mark some questions will be of two mark now let us have a look at the uh, different types of uh, question or the category of the question first option is the first type is the multiple select questions that is msq what are this type of question these questions are objective in nature first of all they each they will have four options that questions will have four, four options out of which one or more than one options may be correct and there is no negative marking or partial marking i will explain you with an example this is one past uh, gate architecture question so identify the pozzolana from the following materials p cement q fly ash r sand s surki and the options are given as a b c d four options are given see the question very carefully this is multiple select questions that means one options may be correct more than one options may be correct but for this question the correct answer is q r s that means pozzolana is fly ash sand surki so for this question you have to mark option a option c option d all three options you have to mark then only you will get full marks for example if you mark only option b which is r s that is also correct but that is partially correct so there will be no marking the point is even if the answer is partially correct or out of a c d three options you are marking only two options though they are correct but there is no partial marking and there is no negative marking so this part uh, in my view will be going to be a tricky for you because you have to mark all the correct options next uh, is the multiple choice questions this type of questions you, uh, we are seeing uh, in the gate for the last uh, many years so multiple choice question means they are they are objective in nature each question will have four options and out of that only one option is correct but here the point is if your answer is wrong there is one third of the negative marking so if correct you will get one if you are wrong then you will get minus one third so you have to be cautious about it let us take an one example that gypsum is added in cement manufacture for the property of option a increasing binding capacity b retarding setting time option c reducing heat of hydration option d increasing strength this is also past year architecture paper so the correct answer is gypsum is added in cement to retard the setting time of cement option b is the correct answer so if you mark option b you will get one mark but if you mark option a c d anything else you will get minus one third so that is the meaning of the multiple choice question let us have a look at the next category that is the numerical answer type question nat so in these questions will be fill in the blank in nature and they are calculation based but there is no negative marking or partial marking c the question is a beam of 50 mm diameter is simply supported at both ends and has an effective span of 6 meter it carries two loads 50 kN each at 1/3 span section modulus of the beam at quarter span in centimeter cube is you have to write the value over here now in the question it is mentioned that you have to answer up to two places up to the decimal after the decimal you have to write two places after the decimal so the correct answer is 12.27 this question is already solved in one of my video please refer to the video for the detailed solution but the point over here is you have to write 12.27 but one point i want to make you clear over here suppose if you write 12.26 or 12.28 or 12.30 then also you will be given marks the range is specified by the computer it will not be visible to you but the range will be given over there that within that range if you answer it you will get marks for example for this question it will be set like 12.25 to 12.35 between this value any value if you write it you will get the full marks 
Now let us have a look. What are the changes in the exam city? Now total one ninety five Indian exam cities are there and five abroad. Uh, but few exam cities have been uh, added as well as uh, some is removed. So let us have a look at it. So Jhansi, Dhenkanal and Chandrapur and Mujaffar Nagar, they have been added for the gate uh, exam city. And Pala, that is uh, under the IIT Madras zone, they, uh, that has been removed from the list of the exam city. Now, uh, in this, uh, in my channel, I will, uh, I have wrapped up the gate structure portion in 2.5 hours. I have also discussed about the soil mechanics, the transportation, the surveying and the environmental engineering all in 1.5 hours. Yes. And um, in my channel, I have also discussed with each topic past 28 years gate architecture questions. They are solved as well as they are explained in detail. In my channel, I am giving you free online doubt clearing session. What you have to do, you have to just drop an email to professor.megadatta.gmail.com with the video reference that with which video you want to have an online free online doubt clearing session. So I will be there with you for the online session to clear your doubt. So uh, this channel I have made it advertisement free just to ensure your seamless learning. So there is no advertisement break in between so that your concentration and attention is not uh, broken in between. So if you find it useful, please share and comment. Your comments will encourage me to upload more videos and please subscribe to get regular updates. I am also on Twitter at the rate Meghadatta B. Please go to the playlist. Uh, and there you can find I have uploaded for the gate portion for the architecture. So thanks for watching.